Yes, I've grown from a man to a god. Road to three plates, back. Fight, not fight. Stay tight, lift it off, and then go down. Up. If I hit this, that's a PR. What? What? How it works is, right, when you have a goal, usually there's like a main story that you follow, yeah. which is the main quest. But then there's also side quests that you can do for fun. It's like a lot of games. I'm not a gamer girl. <laughs> I know, I was not, I've never. It doesn't been. matter. But it's a side quest. A side quest is like. I'm trying, to think, I'm trying to think of a side quest for you. Side quest for you is like doing your deadlifts because you don't really like doing deadlifts, but you know you should. You gotta give me like a this type of like a, the, this type of explanation. All right, guys. So as you can tell, I'm in the gym right now. Today is gonna be a chest day. I'm gonna be training Caleb, which is Dennis's younger cousin. And how old are you, Caleb? How old are you, bro? I'm 16. This guy's this guy's a little baby. But yeah, we also got Josh here. Josh is Josh is doing legs, but he might join us like midway through. How I like to start is we sit forward, lay down. I like to have my eye level under the bar. So my eye level is under the bar, right? And then over here, you see there's these little knurlings. So I put my pinky on the furthest one. Okay. Pinky on the furthest one. Some people when they bench, their elbows will be like out like this, right? You don't want your elbows out like that. You want it tucked in all the time. My butt is on the bed, be on the ground. I'm gonna push up. This might be heavy for you, right? And when I go down, I go down to my nipples. So my lower chest is where I go. I don't go up here. People bench like this, right? Yeah. This is how you injure yourself. You wanna go down. You see how my elbows go, go like downwards and then up. Downwards, up. So that's pretty much uh, how I bench. So I'll have you sit down, and I'll be right behind you spotting. Good, good. So I think you can go a little bit down, because you see how eye level? Yeah. You're a little bit past it, right? So let's go, yeah, that's good. Nice. Two. Do you like bend your wrist back? So try what to I try to do is, that if this is the bar, you want it stacked on the base of your palm. That's all you want. Okay. You can you can have your wrist like this, yeah. but you want the weight right under your wrist. Okay. The problem is when people bench and they put it here. This and is where like yeah back you don't want that. Palm. You want the bar right <laughs> right above this this like line right here, so that everything pushes up together. Okay. Yeah. Right. So even if you do false grip, so this is called false grip, right? Mm -hmm. This is normal bench false grip. As long as the bar is right there. That's all that matters. Okay. So guys, in case you didn't know, I am doing a road to three plate bench. And I've started that already on my TikTok, my Instagram, We're following all those platforms. I already started that. And it's nerve wracking, it's hard guys. I'm currently at this, in this video, I weigh 158. And I'm trying to lean bulk. I'm up four pounds since a month ago. So we're on a good pace. And every day right now is just making sure I'm zoned in, focused. And I gotta make sure to just eliminate all distractions. You know, with the content I'm juggling, um, the workouts, and now the diet, which I've neglected for so long, I really don't have much time to be doing other things. But if I do do other things, something's gonna take an L, whether it's the gym, diet, whatever. So I just gotta say laser focus, um, tunnel vision. That feels like. I think I'm gonna try PR today. I'm gonna try 265 today? <laughs> Shit, I might try. I might try 265 today. I've never done 265. Yeah. We'll see how the workouts feel. So all you really need to focus with your with your one reps is you wanna stay tight the whole time, right? So when you lift off, your abs are flexed, your back's pinched, your feet are planted on the ground. Stay tight, lift it off, and then go down, up. So I'll give you a lift off, okay? So when I give you a lift off, you give me a countdown. Say three, two, one. I'll lift it off for you, it saves you energy. Yeah. When you're in the spot, you say I'm good, I'll let go, and it's all you. Okay. One. Let it. Oh. Oh, you might hit 40 today. That was fast. All right, so as I'm working up to the PR, I'm slowing down one rep at a time, conserving energy, getting a feel of whether I have the right um, strength today. So, play 25 felt good. 
スボシーバーでしょ That's how good. Yeah. They'll push you. And like subconsciously, you'll push yourself. Because like, you'll, you'll, be, you'll be around people that like, you know you can't fuck around with, you know? Yeah. You know if, you're, if you're by yourself, it's like, oh, whatever, I'll just, I'll just chill today, right? Yeah. But when you're with the right people, like, you all push each other. Do I go straight to 265 from the two plates, or do I go to 245? 245 and 270. 270? <laughs> Right. Well, we'll let the 245 determine that. Hey, take off the pump cover! <laughs> Do you know the logic behind slaps? The logic behind slap is... One, you're not supposed to expect it. Yeah. As in, like, you look away, you don't know what I'm going to do with you. Mm -hmm. Second is, you're going to feel the sting, right? Yeah. The sting gives you adrenaline in your body. So your, 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 your mind is rushing with adrenaline. And with that adrenaline, you transfer it to pushing the weight. So that's why, like, when you see, like, guys do it, yeah. it gets them hyped up. Because once you feel the pain, it's like, yo, like, this is, like, instant pre. Like, fight or flight. So it's giving you, like, fight, not flight. Not flight, okay, fight. <laughs> okay. Ready? I don't know. I felt like I, I was pushing it, but like, yeah, I could have gone way harder. Right. So I feel like once you press it, it was almost like you were like doing that, yeah. right? So that's your body trying to compensate for a weaker side, whether it's your left or right. Your body's trying to like, oh, my right side's stronger, so let's try to push more with the right. But then, just the fact that you get off path. It makes you like, it throws off the whole lift completely. Um, I think what you need to practice right now is when you do your normal working sets, just practice the bar path, right? So when I, when I say bar path, you know it goes down your chest, you know it goes straight back up. The more you do that, once you do your one rep, you're like, it only follows that path. Yeah. If it goes out of it, I'm already fucked anyways. All right, this is 245. I've hit this before, but hypothetically, I should be comfortable hitting this again. Should be. You know, the best thing about the gym that I love the most is a little anxiety that you get in wondering whether or not you're gonna hit the lift. This is the best natural high in life that you don't need to take anything for. Like, it's, it's the thrill of like accomplishing your goals and like getting shit done. Getting what you want done and you know it's from all the hard work you've been putting in in the past. Like, it's the best feeling ever. Like guys, that's the shit that you get high on in life. You got 265 on the bar. If I hit this, that's a PR. I feel, I feel the nerves. And we're on the road to three plates. I believe I can get this, so just gotta lock in and stay focused. Go. <laughs> That's definitely a PR. That's a PR, baby. We got that on video. Let's go. It just mentally, once you lock in, you know you got it. That's a big push. On I just broke a barrier now. I know I can hit it. I actually go all the way down now, as if it's bench, 
and then I push back up. But you gotta make sure your elbows, they don't go out. They go, they go tucked in, yeah. And make sure that you're getting a stretch at the bottom, push up. I didn't care that I couldn't do it, I'm still pushing. Because the longer you stay there, the more that muscle is getting trained in that area. So you give me no reason for me to stay close to you. Tell me what love for us do. How are we still breathing? It's never for us to choose. So I'll be the strength in you. Is I like to put my head right there and then to make him mad and be like, Yeah, she's so annoying. I just want to, like, boom. There's no point standing around. We'll only be showered by more boulders. Ready your horses on the double. Be honest. Are all of us riding to our deaths? <laughs> yes, we are. And since we're dying anyway, you're saying that it's better <laughs> if we at least die fighting? I am. But wait, if we'll die anyway, then who cares what we do? We could just disobey your orders, and it wouldn't mean a thing, would it? Yes, you're precisely right. <laughs> Everything that you thought had meaning, every hope, dream, or moment of happiness, none of it matters as you lie bleeding out on the battlefield. None of it changes what a speeding rock does to a body. We all die. But does that mean our lives are meaningless? Does that mean that there was no point in our being born? Would you say that of our slain comrades? What about their lives? Were they meaningless? <laughs> they were not! Their memory serves as an example to us all! The courageous fallen! The anguished fallen! Their lives have meaning because we, the living, refuse to forget them! And as we ride to certain death, we trust our successors to do the same for us! Because my soldiers do not buckle or yield when faced with the cruelty of this world! My soldiers push forward! My soldiers scream out! My soldiers rage! One more, I'm spawning you. Seven, keep going. Go. Eight. Come on, come on. Nine. Ten. Up, up, up. Hold, hold, hold. Slow negative, slow negative. Slow! Slow negative, slow negative. Oh my god, you would go forever. Yeah, where's, like where's, kicking. where's all that energy coming from? Baseline Janice is already like energetic, but her on Crete? Her on Crete? It's times a hundred. Oh. 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 oh my god! If you enjoyed today's video, do me a favor, drop a like, drop a comment. That's all for me. Until then, catch me on the next Daily on the Daily. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Road to 3 Play Bench Series Part 4. And boy, do I have something exciting to share with you guys. So, right now we've got 205 on the bar, and this